Okay. This dungeon place is, um... It's something. It's, it's really something. I mean... I, I can't even... Oh, I just, did I just lose the clock? I'm, Oh yeah, and the problem is, when you die once, you might as well just die all over again so you can save your lives. So, that's what I'm going to do. Alright, we're back, so... Get the clock. Okay, now be careful here. Basically, you have to, like, keep the clock until the end or something. I forgot what I have to do here, but... After all, this is just my strategy. And, yeah, these weird fish guys are back. Dracula really does have everything, huh? Okay, um... Yeah, skip the freaking holy water. It's better to have the clock. Okay, wait for the thing to come and jump on the thing, go down, crouch down, oh, oh god, oh god, okay, that was, that was kind of scary, I must have made. okay, just wait for the thing to come, wait for the freaking thing to come, hit, go down, okay, good, 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 just, just, I'm not even gonna try to hit any of these candles while I'm moving on a platform, that's so dangerous since you can't control your jumps like in Mario, that's really dangerous. Look, oh, almost one hour of recording. Wow. Now this part is funny because look, look what you freaking do. You just move, like just walk this road and kill the hunchbacks that these. Um, I guess they're like seagulls. Okay, they're not freaking seagulls. What the hell am I talking about? They're like pigeons or something. They're like giant pigeons dropping hunchbacks. You just walk this everlasting road and kill them basically the point of this whole freaking part right here. You just do this the whole the whole freaking time. And then this this guy comes. Oh what? The, the, the fireball's still hit. Oh that that's awesome. That's freaking great. And we got the knife, though, to be honest, we don't really need a clock anymore. Okay, actually, I could have used the clock here. Hey, at least we got here with all three lives. That, that's the, really the only important thing. Okay, so these dragon guys can drop a lot of money. I guess they're not really dragon, they're more like, like serpents or something. Shoot fireballs, yeah. Everything shoots fireballs, like, seriously. Just crouch down and kill the guy. Okay, kill the guy. Kill the guy. Oh. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Oh. There we go. And now, this is the fourth boss. Yeah, already. That was a pretty short level. But, um, yeah, this is the fourth boss. And I'm just gonna stack up a little bit. And the fourth boss is Frankenstein's monster. That's right. That's a weird fourth boss, am I right? I mean, Frankenstein's monster. Even he works for Dracula? Yeah, everyone works for Dracula, man. And I died, but I kind of expected that, honestly. That's a really hard boss, and yeah, I I tested the clock out of, like a long time ago, and the clock doesn't work, unfortunately, on him. Which means you have to do it with your own wit. He's actually probably one of the hardest bosses in this game. I would say probably the third or second hardest boss in this game. Yeah, Frankenstein's monster. Which does make sense. He's basically the second... Um, he's basically second to Dracula. And yeah, I did say Frankenstein's monster, not Frankenstein. I know my history, man. I know my freaking movie history. Yeah, everyone says Frankenstein. But it's actually not his real name. People should finally know this stuff. I mean, seriously. Everyone says it wrong for some reason. Okay. I guess the hunchback is like his the assistant of the one the Frankenstein the one who made the monster. Yeah, that makes sense. I wonder. And the, yeah, the problem with this hunch, the reason why for this um, the why Frankenstein's monster is so hard is because of the hunchback here. The hunchback can't die. Okay, so he just keeps 
shooting fireballs. He's not like the other hunchbacks. He's invincible. He can if you hit him, he just stops moving for a little bit, but then he starts moving again. And start and keeps shooting you, but yeah. He can't die, he's not like the other hunchbacks, he's a special hunchback. And he's really annoying. That's basically all I have to say. Yeah, all you can do is really just throw knives at Mr. Frankenstein's monster over there and hope that he dies before you do. That's basically the whole thing. That hunchback is basically the reason why that boss is so hard. I can't even talk about this while freaking doing it, man. What? Come on. Really? I really deserve that. Oh, come on. What? What is this? What the crap's going on? Great. I only have, like, one hit. Well, technically not, but yeah. Just a little more in one hour of recording. I'm gonna try killing Frank size monster before that one hour comes. Okay, come on. Go! Oh, wow. That was, um, gold. Wow, I think I lost. Okay, this, I lost. I definitely lost. It's really hard to time these freaking serpents. And I die. Great. Well, I'm not gonna beat this level until the one hour mark. After the one hour mark. You've got to be joking. I mean, this game is so hard. Such a hard game. What the hell? Time to commit suicide. Ah. No. Okay, I'm really getting infuriated right now. No, look at that! Look at that! Did you see that? Show that again. No, look at that! I can't... He was literally on his last life. Oh my god. How did that happen? Ah. Okay. Now I'm really angry. I better do it this time where I'm... Oh my god. How did that happen? No. <laughs> uh.
Yes! Finally! Oh, that took forever. I mean, seriously. Oh my god. Finally. Finally. I did it! He's dead. That's the hardest boss ever. Anyways, next level. Oh. So this is the fifth level. Yep, this is the fifth level. Man, I need a break. I really need a break. <laughs> 